Good afternoon. Welcome to the Daily Office. I'm so glad you could join me and thank you. This is evening prayer for Saturday, November 12th. It's the 25th week after Pentecost and week 5 in our psalm cycle. And the scripture for this service, Psalm 136, Joel chapter 3, verse 9 to 17. Now please join me in singing the first verse of Psalm 66 by Isaac Watts to the tune of New Britain. Sing all you nations to our God. Sing with a joyful noise, with melody of sound record. God's honors and your joys. Open my lips, my mouth shall declare your praise. Hallelujah, oh give thanks to the Most High, for God is good, God's mercy endures forever. Hallelujah, Psalm 136. And please recite it with me. Hallelujah, oh give thanks to the Most High, for God is good, God's mercy endures forever. O oh, give thanks to the God of gods, for God's mercy endures forever. O oh, give thanks to the Most High of the High, for God's mercy endures forever. Who alone does great wonders, for God's mercy endures forever. Whose wisdom made the heavens, for God's mercy endures forever. Who stretched out the earth above the waters, for God's mercy endures forever. Who made great lights, for God's mercy endures forever. The sun to rule by day, for God's mercy endures forever. The moon and stars to rule by night, for God's mercy endures forever. Who smote Egypt in their firstborn, for God's mercy endures forever. And brought out Israel from among them, for God's mercy endures forever with a strong hand and with a stretched out arm, for God's mercy endures forever. Who divided the Red Sea into parts, for God's mercy endures forever, and made Israel to pass through the midst of it, for God's mercy endures forever. But threw Pharaoh and his army into the Red Sea, for God's mercy endures forever. Who led the people through the wilderness, for God's mercy endures forever. Who smote great kings, for God's mercy endures forever, and slew famous kings, for God's mercy endures forever. Sihon, the king of the Amorites, for God's mercy endures forever, and Og, the king of Bashan, for God's mercy endures forever, and gave their land for a heritage, for God's mercy endures forever. A heritage to Israel, God's servant, for God's mercy endures forever. Who remembered us in our lowly estate, for God's mercy endures forever, and has redeemed us from our enemies, for God's mercy endures forever. Who gives food to all flesh, for God's mercy endures forever. O oh, give thanks to the God of heaven, for God's mercy endures forever. Glory to you, source of all being, eternal word and Holy Spirit, as in the beginning, so now and forever. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. O oh, give thanks to the Most High, for God is good, for God's mercy endures forever. Hallelujah. A reading from the prophet Joel, chapter 3, beginning at verse 9. Proclaim this among the nations. Prepare war. Stir up the warriors. Let all the soldiers draw near. Let them come up. Beat your plowshares into swords and your pruning hooks into spears. And let the weakling say, I am a warrior. Come quickly, all you nations, all around. 
gather yourselves there. Bring down your warriors, O Yahweh. Let the nations rouse themselves and come up to the valley of Jehoshaphat, for there I will sit to judge all the neighboring nations. Put in the sickle, for the harvest is ripe. Go in, tread, for the winepress is full. The vats overflow, for their wickedness is great. Multitudes, multitudes in the valley of decision. For the day of the Most High is near in the valley of decision. The sun and the moon are darkened and the stars withdraw their shining. The Most High roars from Zion and utters his voice from Jerusalem and the heavens and the earth shake. But the Most High is a refuge for his people, a stronghold for the people of Israel. So you shall know that I, Yahweh your God, Dwell in Zion, my holy mountain, and Jerusalem shall be holy, and strangers shall never again pass through it. Here ends the lesson. And now we are bold to say, Our beloved which art in heaven, holy is your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Forgive us as we forgive others. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours now and forever. Let us pray. We stand in awe of the works of your hands and thank you for your everlasting love. May you ever protect us and deliver us from all enemies. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. We trust in the mercy of God forever. And may the God of hope fill us with all joy and peace in believing through the power of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Hallelujah.